With a quick save I also saw that we've hit the hour mark so I put a cut in the episode and now it's we're on part 2. Uh, just in YouTube video terms it's at the same time for me. So I'm just gonna move her up. I'm gonna move the exalted and I think I'm gonna bring her somewhere around here just to take these guys down without using any ammo if possible. I'm here. Um, this might be very dangerous, we'll see. Sophia, there's nothing that I want to do with you. I guess with the shotgun user, we'll want to move her forward. You are still in panic. This one is in panic. Let's take the Exalted forward first. Maybe just free the space there by doing this. And then I'll bring her here. Is this close enough to where we could do something like this? Yeah. We could also mind control. I feel like killing it might be a better idea. But also trying to spot the enemies forwards is good. Let's be patient. We have the ability to shoot at the Yugov here. You can see that the Yugov has like this opening where we can shoot. This will go up and down as we fight. And thus you are not able to sh shoot constantly at it and you are not able to take down those... Uh, I don't know, scales. Here, what are we going to shoot at? Poison worm abdomen, its torso. Let's shoot at its torso. We are still bleeding with you, which is a bit unfortunate. Now let's make sure that we're taking good cover here. Okay, reload. Bring you forward, and I am just gonna shoot at the torso once again, trying to take it down. We're not far off from doing that. Okay, Sophia, let's bring you forward here. We have to be careful with that sniper, maybe we'll be able to detect it soon and we can take some shots. the heavy I'm just gonna move you forward let's see can I hit any of the enemies that matter for us not really let me bring you around And I guess I'll bring this sniper around as well. Okay, there we go. Okay, you have recovered. Five will points, it's losing nine, eight during the next turn. It might be able to attack us. Yeah, a bit of poison there, it's unfortunate, but maybe we should do this. It does not cure his bleeding. Taking aim. Let's see, what are we going to shoot at now? Probably the torso seems like it's going to do the most damage. Okay, now we'll shoot with you. Did we sh hit our own man? I think we just did. Acquiring target. Okay. This will help. We'll reduce the will points of the enemies in the area. Yeah, you can see that they're panicked now. 
Takeshi, I'll move you forward. I will move Sofia forward as well. Bring up the snipers. I think we have to make way because the exalted cannot move through here. I thought that she might be able to, but it doesn't seem like it did. Like she can. We're getting so so much lag because we are ru ruining the environment here. Come get some. Let's see if I move you a bit forward. Apparently. Oh, good. So we see the Triton here. I would really love to take control of it. Can we do that? Don't think we are far enough to do it or close enough to do it. Let's see. Maybe with the priest, maybe with someone else. I want to give you points. Get closer here. I think our exalted might be in some trouble now. Right, because it has been spotted. If I move you up to here, I wonder if I'll be able to give it some. Okay, I can. So let's take cover. And I should probably do this kind of mine crash for a while. Just because we can do a lot of attacks like this. Here comes the Phoenix. Okay. Now this artillery we pretty much taken care of. I will bring you forward. How close will I have to be to do this? Does it have a range? It doesn't say. She has only 7 will points though. So that is unfortunate. Just gonna have to do this. For a second. Priest. I will try to bring it as close as I can. Any chance? You need just a bit more. I will give you two points from this position. Get you... See two steps closer. Oh, I can. Oh, but it's 19 will points. That is so much. Still. And I can cause some damage. Spawns missed. We can even shoot at the Yugov, take off its tentacles. Or shoot at this guy. Oh, yeah. Apparently, we're not insured to do good damage there. Have a better chance somewhere up here. Let's do that. And I am going to bring the sniper closer here. If we're losing control over it, we might just get another sh chance to shoot. So that's what I'm thinking. Ready. Let's see, can I give you like two more points and. Okay, we're just gonna take a shot here. Ah, 
we missed with it. Don't think I can give it any more points with any of the characters. No, he, she's too far. Or he's too far. I was imagining that maybe I can give it some point. Oh, but the, until you released, there's no chance of doing that. Okay. Frankie, I'll just bring you forward. The mutoid, I'm bringing you forward as well. Let's see, so you have recovered from your panic. We have an Arthron Scorch champion going forward. The Yurgoth is going to throw a Mark of the Void. So let's see, the Yurgothian Receptacle applies dangerous marks of the Void on, to our operatives, damaging them and nearby allies every turn. We should aim for the creature's eyes, disabling an eye will remove one of those marks. Okay. This is a bit different than what I thought it would be. Now, I thought... Ooh, we can take a shot at one of the eyes. Disabled one of them. Okay, so it's damaging nearby allies. Not what I thought it would be doing. You still have good will points here. So, let's see. We are in range. I am going to release with the priest because we don't have much left. And maybe we can do this. That's another 19 cost. But apparently we can shoot again. <laughs> Okay. This feels like something that we could cheat on, right? Try to overuse this ability. Shoot at the tentacles. Sure. Let's disable a tentacle. Tentacles just protect eyes. That's what they do. I can continue to take care of this or I could bring her... Let's release. Once again. I am going to bring the Exalted forward. I'm gonna try to take control with her. Apparently, that is not something that we can do anymore. Or she doesn't have enough will points to where she could do that. I, I think we need more will points than what the enemy has. Well, it was nice while, we, while it lasted. But I think at this point we just have to do this. We still know where it is, so we're just gonna do... yeah. this shot here. How much can we do? What do you think? Get here. Now from this position that you got might be able to put a mark. Okay. Well, let's retreat. Go with free aim. I like this over the XCOM games because just because you know where something is, then it gives you an opportunity to cause it damage, and I feel like that is a good mechanic rather than just waiting for things to happen. Okay, that's one shot, and we're gonna do a second shot here. 
taking a lot of damage. Moving to position. So with the mark, I don't think that the priest protects us because it doesn't say that it's doing any kind of psychic attack. It just says that it puts marks on. Okay, so that creature died, the sniper died. I can do this. Ready. Trying to think how to best prepare to go forward. Okay. Let's wait this turn. I'm gonna do another quick save from here on out, just so we don't have to repeat this whole thing. And then I'm going forward. There's a sniper rifle here, which might be a good idea to take. Let's see, can't do anything... Well, I can I can do a bit of mind crush. But she still needs to recover some points. Do you have return fire? Yes. Receiving. Thus we have to be careful on how we use your abilities. I would like you to recover some points. I'm prepared. I think I need to do recover there as well. What do we do here? Do I just start shooting at it? And get out? Probably. We might be take some damage here, but I feel like going into an overwatch like this is good. Don't know how far it's willing to walk, but I'm just gonna do something like so. We are going to take a shot up here, trying to keep this guy infected and lost if possible. Yeah, we're gonna wait one more turn here, just so you know. It can be, this can be very problematic as a tactic. As you do not want to sit around for too long, reinforcements will be dropping in. Okay, let's bring you here. I'm on Overwatch. Now what I'm hoping is that because we are out of cover with one of your our people, then they will bring in their own. Did I remember to do a... Wow. <laughs> that was so dumb there. Come on. At least have these overwatches work. And she moved out. So, what do I do? What can I do here? First of all... I will have to take the siren out. So that's why you do not want to wait for too long here. Ah, come on. Good. Can't wait. I've got this. So between the siren and the guy with uh eyes peeled with the grenade launcher yeah. we we are in trouble not a whole lot but still okay. 
Let's do this mind crush here. There we go, we got 10 will points back. I can go forward here. I can't do mind crush just yet because we have our friend in range. Let me bring you very close to you. And just kill you. Good. With that in mind, you are panicked. I could take control of you. Which wouldn't be necessarily a bad idea. We might attract the mark on him. You know what? We have 19 will points. Okay. It did not cost anything because we're in panic. And with this, during the next turn, we might be able to move and maybe we've even attracted a mark, which, you know, will help us. Sniper. I'm going to bring you forward. And we're gonna shoot at that guy. Okay, let's bring you here. Gonna keep the exalted back for a second. Move the heavy on this side. We can take some shots at the Yugoth apparently from here. Which is not necessarily a bad idea, but it's probably better to shoot at that guy at the top. But we're not causing it any damage, apparently. We're too far. Okay, this one is in panic. That guy recovered. It might just be able to shoot. We got the mark of the void, let's see. Is it on... You. Yes. I mean, this works well for us. Let's make sure that we're taking some good shots. Whoa. We can try to shoot at that. It's not a sniper rifle, but... Every little damage counts, I guess. So we have to be careful not to be around it. Ready to fire. With you. Yeah, let's try to do some damage here. Maybe a little damage and go forward. Um. Let's shoot at this guy, because I want him to be in panic as well. I feel at this point, like, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, so I can move this forward and we will need to make sure that we're taking some shots okay we spotted a new enemy now they will these enemies will spawn all around us that's why we will need to make sure that we're making good progress Got some damage there with Nina. I'll bring you forward. We're risking getting some spawns right behind us that will act and will shoot. But what can you do? I mean, it is the final mission. We need to try our best here. He doesn't seem to be able to heal anytime soon. Loud and clear. Or our sniper. I can even shoot at this guy. But he's a melee. So I don't really care about him. Okay. Let's see, Takeshi. I'll bring you forward here as well. And I'll ask you to take some shots up there. 
and keep the Exalted in the back just for a second longer. The Heavy, bring you forward and let's see. Good, good, disable the torso and cause bleeding. Let's see. We have another Siren coming up. The Yugov just threw another mark on someone. This is going to start firing upon us. Let's see. Okay, it missed some things. I do love when they miss. Cool, we've taken down one of the big guys. There's a mark now on Frankie. But we have two marks. We need to hit eyes in order to remove them. I can damage you, or I can damage you. Point blank shots on the siren. In please and thank you. I will bring Frankie here. Ah. Didn't hit and didn't manage to hit anything. Disabled its head. Let's try to kill it. That didn't work. I would have liked to have known whether we are in range to take damage. As I do not know if that is the case. Why should they set you? Will it remove the mark? No. Okay. Well, now we know a thing. Okay, we hit our own. Let's see, I'll bring her here first. I was hoping that we'd have the chance to mind control someone. But it doesn't seem like that is the case. Okay, let's give Frankie some points. And I will move it somewhere here. Mostly because it will not be able to lose its health. You have some troubles, Ina. Let me give you these points. Ready. And let's recover your Rest. will points. I can kill you. Or I can try to... Ah! Do that guy. Ready to engage. Come on. Sniper shot, once again, like we can take that guy down, or we can try to shoot at this. I like, feel like doing that is better. Jacob, what can I do with you? Well, we can take some shots. Let's see if we can take care of that artillery up there. And I'll move you forward. Let's see what's going to happen now. So... This thing is in pan, this artillery unit, and that's that works for us. There's another mark being applied, and I'm guessing it's going to be applied on our... Uh... Yeah, we lost some points there. Okay, it didn't... I thought it would apply a mark on the Exalted, but it did not. I'm gonna go forward here. We're gonna do some mind crushing. I feel like that is a good way to recover some points here, right? Ooh. Arton 
Umbra. So this is something that is gonna get resurrected here in a second. It's a bit annoying. I do not like it. Should I take control of the Hydra? We don't have a lot of points. I feel like doing this is probably a bit better. The Mutoid is taking damage and I... Because of its mark, I don't think that it will survive another round. I'm gonna move Sophia forward. Taking aim. Okay, we're gonna kill the Siren. This is a bit problematic here. You have... Frankie has a mark. Let's do this first. I'm ready. Because I want to move her away from this. As I will want to do the same with the Exalted. We are going to retreat it. And let's see. Yeah, I can bring you here and heal you. Let's take the snipers. Ready to fire. And take some shots here. Heading out. You haven't seen Penumbras yet because it has been one of the latest evolutions. Once again, it's not really a good idea to wait too much within the game because a lot of things will happen. A lot of evolutions and thus become the gaming big will become more difficult but what this basically is it's going to rise a new type of enemy which is not the toughest but it's like having a resurrection Reloading. okay how and where could I move in such a way that is far enough from people to take damage. Not in many places. I will move the heavy forward over here and we'll just oh, see if we can take you take the artillery down. And we managed to take the artillery down, we gain some more will points. And now it's pretty much time. To focus on moving forward and taking down the the big boss. I think we're safe here. So look at that. This is the new enemy. You go for receptacle just threw another mark of the void. We are getting another Myrmidon in our pack. Yeah. Is it going to kill it? Yep. That was probably the best idea for it and the best situation for us as well. What's the plan? You reload and let's see. There it is. A good shot. Okay, that's one shot and two shots. Does it still have a pincer? It still has a pincer. Ranky, I am going to ask you to kill it. And then I'm going to ask you to go forward. Jacob. Yeah, please do not shoot the exalted. I'm going to go forward here. We'll reload with Nina. Channel open. Sophia, I am going to ask you to take this upper path here. Acquiring. But maybe after you kill this. Target Target missed. Ah. Five by five. Whew. 
So, you go off. It seems like I have a position on a shot on you. Well, not that much. Very low chance that we will pass through. But we are going to try it. There seems to be... Is it a mark? Mark of the Void? Yeah, there is a mark on the sniper as well. Which really means we have to rush here. The more of our guys have the mark, the worse it will be for us. Because we can't keep them one near the other, especially. I'm here. Let us take you forward. The Exalted, you stay here for a second. Takeshi, you do not have a mark. I'm just gonna bring you here. The Yugoth applied another mark. We have to take out its eyes if we want to have any kind of chance of... How many is five? It says five. Okay, oh, so the sniper... Yeah. Now Nina got a mark. Let's see, where is the opening? The opening is on the left. So I'm going to try to get up here with Sophia first. Did we spot another enemy? Yeah, there's another one spawning right behind us. We really have to move here. Make sure that we take out some of its eyes, otherwise those marks will kill us. I will move forward with Nina. Identifying targets. No way that makes sense, maybe? Let's see. Bring you here. The Exalted. I will want you to recover for now. Frankie, I'll bring you forward. And probably I could heal you. All set. Or I could ask Nina to heal. Let's see. Go with Takeshi forward here. Is it one, two, three, four? Almost five, I guess I'm gonna move slightly to the left. Go on an overwatch there. Yeah, we'll heal with Frankie. Ready. It is. Do we have a some sort of healing grenade on any of you? No. So this is pretty bad. Let's see if there's any on the ground here. No, there's not. Ah! Receiving loud and clear. I hate missing. I hate missing with a passion. I can bring the heavy forward here. Because I could do at least a normal heal. And Jacob forward now. We'll bring the heavy forward. Is it five steps? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. It's okay at least. Can we cause... We can cause it to panic. Sure, let's do that, just so we don't take damage for a turn here. And then I'm gonna bring you forward. Poof! It's pretty stressful to get this far and try to make it. Okay, we have an opening to the left, we might have the chance to, to attack. Let's see, yep, but I am hoping that we will not discover any enemy here, otherwise we are in trouble. 
Okay, we can see its eyes. If we're lucky, we're gonna remove... Ah! We, we had some damage there, but it wasn't enough. Let's see. I don't think we'll have a chance to give points, nope. That is one attack. Nina, I would like you to heal yourself first. And we'll see what we do next. It really depends on what's gonna happen. Jacob now has a mark. Irina has a mark as well. We can do that. Let's see if we can shoot with the pistol in a way that will kill it. How much bleeding does this do? 20 and it has 18 hit points. Great. That's actually really good for us. Let me go forward here with the exalted. Takeshi, I'll bring you here. And we're gonna try to take some shots. To fire. Okay. Not exactly special. But I'm gonna do another one. Ready to engage. We shall see. I'll just keep it for the moment. Let's see, she's not far five steps away. This might be a problem. Ah, missed. You. I think I'm just gonna bring you somewhere here, Jacob. Targeting. I really don't want him to be too close to anyone. Or our heavy will bring him up. And is this is all the party that we have left to move. So I can either take a shot with you, which might do enough damage to kill, or I could throw a grenade. Which would be like 20 acid. <sighs> it's not really gonna be enough to kill it. But you know what? We're gonna go Overwatch. We'll see what it does, and I feel like Overwatch is better. We're gonna take some damage there, I'm sure of it. Moving to position. There we go. Okay. That enemy died. The Yugoth is now throwing another mark, which will damage us. We have another shield bearer walking. Come on. Ah. Very close, but not close enough. So we can take control here, or I could do this. There's a mark now on you. Switching. Let's see. Shooting at its head. That's one shot. Two shots. Okay, that's one shot once again. Nina is okay as far as health goes. So I can give you another chance to shoot. Those tentacles are protecting the eyes. Let's see if we can manage to squeeze a second shot here. Take you forward. With the sniper it might be just a tiny bit better even though we don't have the best position. It didn't work. 
Jacob, I'm gonna heal you first. Or the Exalted. Probably should move her just forward here. There might be another enemy spawning in from that direction. Ooh, bring Frankie forward. I'm ready. I mean, there's a problem with this guy spawning here, but if I bring Frankie forward, he might just be able to take a really good shot at one of its eyes. Look at this. Did we? Did we? We did! We disabled... We actually disabled the mark on Frankie. With you here... We are going to get attacked there, I'm sure of it. But if I bring you forward... And I give you this point... Another shot there, we took out another mark. And actually it was the mark on the priest. Let me move the exalted back here. It is a bit dangerous because a mark might be placed on her. But there we go. Ready to fire. With you we can shoot from this distance. And take some of your tentacles away. Sure. Taking the tentacles does not do it anything. Except uh, the part where it's protecting its eyes. That's all that it does. Uh, Penumbra is getting resurrected. Let's see. Do we still have a mark? We still have a mark on the sniper. I am going to bring it on this side. And I am going to have to heal you during the next turn. Definitely. So this is our last action. Let's see. Okay. So the Artron Shield Bearer was spawned. And the Umbra is coming towards us. The Yugov is throwing a mark somewhere. And we have an opening to our left. Let's see. Where is the mark? No choice but to keep going. Not sure. But let's heal first of all with our sniper. Oh, it's back on Frankie. Good to know. Can I take control of this guy? He has a lot of will points, so I'm guessing not. I have an opportunity to take a few more eyes out. Ooh, so far so good. What do I do? Do I focus on him? Or do I focus on the guy in front of us, which probably <laughs> would be our biggest threat right now? But I am willing to sacrifice a few soldiers if it means winning here. Okay. I am definitely, uh, the, with the fact that I have ammo, I am definitely in the best situation I've ever been in this game. I can get closer, let's get closer with the Exalted here. And I can do some mine crushes actually. Which is not a bad idea to be honest. Huh. That paid off a lot better than I thought it would. Okay, shooting another one of its eyes. What's our move? With Takeshi, I'm just gonna bring Moving you out. closer and we're gonna try to take the Artron down. 
Disabled its arm, let's see, it takes 10 HP damage, okay, it's not enough yet. So how am I going to do this? How will we bring you here? It would give us a line of sight. We'll bring you here, make sure that Takeshi gets its points. Let's see. Yep. We fight together or we die alone. Aiming. Let's see. Good. So that is what we want from that. I can take a huge shot with the heavy here. Which would cause quite a bit of damage, like if I shoot especially here in the middle apparently. I see none of its eyes that is still functioning. Oh, or there. Managed to hit it, which removed another one of the marks. This enemy will have an opportunity to reach us at some point, but I feel like if I move them around here, it's not gonna be as bad. And you can see right now that since we've taken most of its eyes out, it's very good for our party. They're not losing any kind of health. But the big issue that we have here is the fact that if I didn't have enough ammo, taking the rest of its health down would have been a pain. Because we really need to take out 3200 from the total it still has. And I can't really disable parts like and cause bleeding like in What's our plan? other situations where we fought enemies. I can put a mark for death, which might be a good idea. Reload the pistol. Let's reload the pistol, sure. And I'm gonna get you a bit closer. We'll have a mark on our sniper. We'll have to see how we play this off. Just gonna move the Exalted to the side slightly. And we can still take some shots here. Do we see its other eye that is still okay? Just slightly. Just cause some damage there. With the heavy... I can move you forward, so let's move you forward just to get away from the enemy that's coming right behind us. This mission almost took two hours to complete. The mark is on the Exalted. It's not really a good position to fire from. But we're gonna try it either way. Okay, bring Sophia forward. Let's see. Okay, that is still that is not that good. Let's see if we can hit it at some point where it's vulnerable, like now. Yep, that worked. Sure, we'll bring the shotgun here as well. What do we want to hit? I think we just want to hit everything, like just generally doing damage. I will recover with the Exalted. With this other soldiers i guess i could go forward and see if i can give some action points away right once again we have enough ammo here to do a lot of damage shoot at its head we'll do that with takeshi what I am going to do, let's see, do you have a, you have a grenade. Let's see now. We'll heal these. Okay, Sophia's okay. Where is the penumbra? It's here. So it's not in a good position, I would say. 
I'll try to move our priest forward, see if we need any kind of protection or anything. We can get or need any kind of protection. Let's see, what else are we going to do? Uh, Jacob, Jacob, Jacob. Okay, I'll do that overwatch there. Keep you here. And I'll bring our sniper up on the right. Let's see what the Yugo... This might be the final turn of the Yugo, which would make me so happy. Okay, they don't respond to overwatches. Ooh. Gonna get a double shot? No. But that... That hurt in its own way. So we have an opening here. One eye, two eyes. Disable one of them. I'm ready. Sophia, let me bring you here. Taking aim. We'll take another aim at one of its eyes. Okay. Um, shotgun user. Yeah, we're gonna bring you here as well. I see no other eyes that needs to be taken care of. We'll just damage it. Hey, okay, Takeshi. I am going to bring you here. We're just gonna focus fire on the you got for now. I feel like that might be the best idea. Oh, almost took it out. I am so excited. Oh. Merge the Exalted with the defeated Yugov. Don't tell me that you can't move out of the way. You can't move out of the way. Is there any other enemy? The enemies are still here, so we have to get the Exalted close. Man, after spending... Almost a day, like a day I consider a day being the time that I can record doing this. And now finally winning. It is so good. In the end, it wasn't her powers or her followers that allowed us to win. It was her humanity. An alien god spoke to her in her mind. And instead of being dominated or obliterated, she tricked him. By the time he realized what she was doing, it was too late. She'd stolen his knowledge, cut him off from his armies on Earth. He was alone on his dark planet, and humanity was saved. The war wasn't over, of course. It's never that simple. There were still those who wanted to go back to how things were before, to make the same mistakes again. But the Exalted would not allow it. New Jericho fought to the end. She respected that. Tobias West and his people believed in their principles and died for them. With them died the last fragment of the old world. Sinedrin continued to exist. This was not the future they dreamed of, but somewhere in this changing world there was space for their ideas. They would contribute what they could and hope that conflict could be avoided. Like everyone, they had had enough of war. Humanity began to adapt and evolve. No longer bound by the chains of an imperfect biology, human beings finally flourished. The belief in the dead god and the hierarchies of the disciples fell away. It was no longer necessary to believe in some distant deity when the Exalted walked among us. As for the Phoenix Project, we went back to the shadows for a while. We knew the war wasn't over. Up there, in celestial darkness, something ancient and powerful still hungered for our planet. But next time, next time, we'd be ready. And there we have it, we managed to win this mission.
I am so happy. For the very first time, you witness me winning at Phoenix Point. Playing from beginning to end. I'll be honest that I am curious to see what the other campaigns have to offer. Is this, like, are we going to be fighting uh, the same boss? Is this the same story? Because if you take out the disciples, right, there's no connection anymore between the entity and the disciples. So who knows exactly what the other factions, what other stories they have. So if you want to see more, do let me know. You know, it doesn't have to be at the time of posting. Maybe it's somewhere in the future. I might return back to this. But uh, how soon or how late it will be, you'll have to encourage it or discourage it. Let's take a look. Haven surviving, Haven destroyed, okay. A few of the stats, reputation, the type of enemies that we've killed, okay. Phoenix forces, battles fought, research and development. Okay, so a few things here and there. Stats, if you are curious to see what's what. Well, hope you have enjoyed it. Uh, thank you very much for watching and for the support you've offered to the Two-Headed Wolf Gaming channel. I really appreciate everything and I wish you all to have a wonderful day.